he had a tester in his pocket and refused to use it to test it to see that they were functioning properly the way they're supposed to. Uh, likewise, he caused false charges to be filed regarding glass in bathroom windows. They were, in fact, acrylic, perfectly legal, and he either refused to or was unable to tell the difference between plastic and glass. Kimberly Blake got caught by multiple witnesses saying that smoke detectors didn't work. Uh, they just went on and on and on, filed many, many false charges against me. Uh, various members along with them. Oops. Uh, on Friday, there's a couple of court appearances that are due, and my damages for currently are at about a half a million, and they're going to go up to in the $2 million range if we can't meet before Friday and at least postpone those court sessions. Thank you. Thank you. Next speaker, please. Um, and I'd also like to thank you, Mayor Lucas, for um, responding to our recent convention on the current status of uh, of Cavity Field. Um, however, we, we we're really hoping to publish much more information. Um, and also, as you're listening to that information that you received from staff and legal counsel, that you keep in mind that there was 61% of the voters in the city who supported the Jeffrey Cavity Hills, or at least defeated that current project that Chevron had proposed. Um, keeping in mind, looking at it in perspective, um, we have some high vote getters in this last election, especially considering the number of uh, 